違い。What's up? What's up? What's up? We're on. We're on. We're live. We're on. We're live. I guess we're doing our best. Come on, focus on me. Focus on me. I'm the important one. Oh, this camera, dude. This camera loves to focus on everything but me. I am the center of attention. It's Pokemon Day, baby. Get a Pokemon gift of some sort. Like that. That one. That one's nice. Watch. Now watch me bring this forward. Watch me instantly go to focus, I'm sure. Focus, focus on, on me. me. Bleep. 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 There I go. Blurry, blurry boy. boy. Thinking about changing everything, man. Thinking about changing the setup. Thinking about the microphone coming from over here. What do you think about that? Hmm? What do you think about that? Microphone over here. That'd be fun. That'd be pretty fun, wouldn't it? It's options. I'm also thinking about getting a cloud lifter and just keeping it across the room. Just calling out to it, dude. Who knows? Who knows what we'll do? There's my coffee. My tea. She's a brewing. Was good. I really haven't had much time to watch the Summer Games Fest stuff still. I've just kind of been looking at the trailers. And, uh, yeah, there's some exciting stuff out there. It looks like a pretty good year. It's a great year to be a gamer, as we always say. What a great year for gaming, folks. Huh? I'm trying to decide what coffee cup I should use. I'm on the fence. I'm on the fence. What does today feel like to everybody? How are we doing? That's what really makes the difference, right? If it's a day that we're feeling something good. What's a trombone? Trombone, trombone Dalek has entered, entered the chat. The chat. It's so loud. It's so loud. It's, it's too, too loud. loud. What's up? What's up? It's the Mondayest of Mondays. Oh, dear. Well, that's no good. Well, that means we need a sad cup. I gotta get a sad cup of some sort. Hmm. <laughs> I've already used my uh, Stardew Valley coffee cup. It's gotta be washed, so. Washed. It's got to be washed before we can do anything else. How was the weekend, trombone and sneaky? There goes the tea. I'm gonna go make me some Assam tea. Be right back. Right, the tea is ready. Hey, y'all got a work meeting, so just gonna be lurking. All good, Perspectives. Happy you're here. Happy to have a lurker. Lurker's welcome. Lurker's welcome and wanted. We're gonna play a couple games today. Before we get into any games, we gotta talk about the mileage. Oh, wait, hang on, that's a good time. Mileage Mania! How to say hello in Zandies. What's up? 
Movie, movie. I'm going to go ahead and get it out. I was already over at it. Movie, movie game and a gotcha pond. Oh, by the way, how about this, Sando? He's going to fall. He's going to fall off. He's too excited. What do you think about that right there, huh? Huh? He goes on a while. It's the whole song. It's the whole song. And he really wiggles, huh? My money don't jiggle jiggle. Wow. There he goes. That's one of the options. That's one of the options. Is it very, very loud? Could you hear it or was it quiet? It feels very loud to me. All right, Zendo, let's see what you got. You sound like everything broke in there. Try, try again. Hey, look at that. You get a second one. Oh, good. You could hear it. It was crazy loud to me. That's just how dynamic this dynamic microphone is. Dynamic microphone. Loud enough to hear clearly. Yeah, it's very loud. So I'm going to stop throwing these because I've started breaking them. <laughs> I'm going to give them a light, a light toss, a lob, if you will. Reverse, reverse. Whenever I start playing um, Monster Sanctuary, I'll turn the controller upside down. But you got it. Don't let me forget. It is not beans, but I do have beans. So literally the earliest convenience that I have to actually stock the doggone thing, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Beans are back. The beans are back, baby. Almost. Soon and very soon. Soon and very soon. All right, let's check some stuff now, huh? We've got some things we got to check out. Okay, Mileage Mania. For those of you that are not participating in our Mileage Mania, what are you thinking? Come on! Earliest convenience, he says. Earliest convenience! I do say that, and I mean it. Um, if you are not participating in our Mileage Mania, you oughta. It's very fun. We're trying to see how far we as a community can walk in miles by the end of June. We set our sights at the goal of 300 miles. And it is June 13th and we are how many miles from 300? 11.2 miles. Friends, 11 miles until we reach 300. Give yourself some chats in the clap, please. We are almost there on day 13. Day 13, are you kidding me? I've got to come up with some big stretch goals. Stretch goals out the wazoo, because I think, I think we're going pretty far, okay? We're definitely getting 500, definitely. definitely, definitely, definitely. 500 has got to be a big one. So what did we unlock, you ask? What are, that's, that's the big question of the day, right? What did you unlock? Well, nothing yet, but you will at 300. But what you did unlock over the break was at 250 miles, if you're over in our Discord, exclamation point, exclamation point Discord in the chat if you ain't in there. What are you thinking? But over in our Discord, I've been posting updates as they've been going live. So when we hit 250 miles, um, I said that I would talk more about it today. You have unlocked, as of 250 miles, the multiplier day. What that means is just like in Pokemon Go or in Pikmin uh, Walk, whatever you, whatever, you know, equivalent you want to make, we are going to have a day, June 25th, the last Saturday of the month, where all of the miles logged on that day. Hmm. Yes. The miles logged for that day. <laughs> That's the word I'd like to use. Not the miles logged on that day, but the miles logged for that day, I will double. So for every mile you walk, I'll give you two. I'm going to be like, like, like the good Lord above in the Gospels. You walk one mile, I'll give you two. So there you go. Multiplier day. Multiplier Saturday! Coming June 25th to a town near you. Double the points. Double the miles on that day. So we'll get a big boost on that day. 
And I've, I've thought, I haven't done this yet, so I'm not gonna make any promises, but I've thought about making a day uh, of goals. So like, uh, however far we reach on that day, you'll get certain unlockables that day. So like if we can log 50 miles that day, that would technically be 100 miles, and I'll give you something like for reaching 100 in a day, because that's insane, right? So that's where we're at, that's what we're doing, um, and that's what you needed to know. Is that fun? Congratulations, folks. You're so close. You're so close to 300. I cannot believe we've almost reached it and we've not even been doing this for two weeks. You guys are insane. You're awesome. You're wonderful. You is kind. You is smart. You is important. We appreciate you. This, is this tea ready? I don't know when I got it. I have no idea when I got this tea. Um, we got a couple games today. A couple games today to play. We have a couple games to play today. The first one is that I want to continue my hand at Pokemon Pocket Crystal. What was it called? League? Pocket Crystal League, which is basically inscription. Um, we're going to continue our journey in that just because I want to see how far I can get. And then we have a game that uh, I finally got my Game Pass working. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much, Xanda. We do have a movie game. I got so distracted talking about Mileage Monday. Here's your movie movie game. And then I'll talk about another game that we have to play, okay? All right. <clears throat> hmm, interesting. I wouldn't have... I don't want to give anything away. Okay. Your prompt, Zando. And for everybody that is watching, do not type in the chat until Zando's had a chance to guess. Don't take his, don't take his dove potentially away from him. Here we go. A man investigates a cover-up behind the assassination of a popular 1960s president by a spacey mental hospital patient that claims he is from a distant planet. I'll read that again. A man investigates a cover-up behind the assassination of a popular 1960s president by a spacey mental hospital patient that claims he is from a distant planet. How did you know that? I've never heard of the second movie. Do I need to see the movie K-Pax? It is JF K-Pax. JF K-Pax, boom, nailed it. What is K-Pax? I've never heard of this movie. Am I supposed to know? Do I need to like lose my nerd card? Am I supposed to know K-Pax? I mean, I've never heard it in my entire life. I also need to remove the tea bag before this gets too tea. Too tea. Too too tea. All right, Assam. Pretty good. Pretty good honey to tea ratio. Not perfect, but pretty good. Never seen it, I'm sure you're fine. K-Pax is a delightful music, movie, but not, not anything big. No, you don't need to know it. I've never even heard of it. Um, this is my Churches for the Nerds mug. Um, I don't even know if it's still for sale on the website. It used to, it was a Checkpoint Church exclusive. So in our first year of Checkpoint, to get things going and get people excited, I thought it'd be kind of fun to do like exclusives and do one product a month that people could buy to support us. And um, that was one of them. Worked in a movie rental store for about four to five years. So you've seen them. You've seen them all. Well, not me, dude. Impressive. Impressive. Con Con congratulations, Zando. I'm so glad I have the microphone back. I hope you never leave me, microphone friend. And now I know where you are in the Walmart. So if you break again, I can find you. This will be mine forever. I will never lose you again. Okay. So we have Pocket Crystal League to play today. And then we also have a Poke clone called Monster Sanctuary. Um, I finally was able to access my Game Pass library. And it was one of the games that's been on there forever. And so I was like in the middle of a download. And then I realized I own this game on Steam. I was like, are you kidding me? We could have been playing this all along. Uh, but I thought it'd be a fun thing to do for Pokemon Day to play a little Poke Clone uh, as we anticipate and wait for the future of Pokemon to come out in November. We still got plenty of games to play. I looked into Pokemon Showdown, and I'm not going to lie, I didn't enjoy it. <laughs> I had the same phenomenon, dude. The exact same phenomenon happened with Pokemon Showdown as happens with every other card game online where it's not fun because so many people have come up with their own meta and they take you out so quickly that it's not even a good time. <laughs> like you can't even you can't even have fun with it because everybody already knows the way to win 
And so there's like three teams you can make in Pokemon that are, you know, the best teams. And if you don't do one of those teams, then your team just absolutely gets wrecked. And that's just not a fun game for me. The fun of Pokemon for me is building the team, right? And so you don't really get to do that as much in Pokemon Showdown. So I'm not as about it. But Monster Sanctuary, I'm about. What does the winner of the Fantasy Critic game win? Bragging rights? I, we never talked about it. We never talked about it. I don't know if H-Man had a plan. That was H-Man's baby, so maybe he had a plan. Uh, but I don't think there's anything in there. Are you going to be the winner? We still have a lot of months to go. But we also... I, I don't know if I want to buy anything else. I don't think I have any room in my... I have one yearly installment, but I don't think they announced any new installments for this year, did they? Stained Glass is almost done. You still have so many games left. That's so insane, Zando. You have seven games left and you're in, in the lead. Wowzers. I didn't know Elden Ring got a 95. Oh my goodness. It's a fine game, dude. <laughs> got a lurk. Got a lurk, got a lurk. Thanks for your lurk. Appreciate ya. Got your pawn for trombone. But you got it. Trombone. Oh, an oldie but a goodie. A celeb reads poetry. Celeb read poetry. Would you like name your celebrity and we'll find a poem? If you have a celeb, I thought about it. I think I need to come. I'm going to write this down before I forget because I will forget. Uh, let's say create. A random celeb, um, whatever they're called, React is what I call them on Twitch. So I'm going to come up with a list of celebs and have it so that you can just click exclamation point celeb if you don't want to come up with one on your own. That way you can do one from my list of things that I can do. Chat can decide. Chat's all lurking. Let's see if I can come up with an RNG. Do you hear that trash truck? Because it's louder It's louder than an airplane. Jeremy Piven, I don't have one. Bob Saget, I don't have one. Don't have one, don't have one, don't have one, don't have one, don't have one. <laughs> don't have one. Cat Stevens. Now that's interesting, isn't it? I'm a ball of peace train. Truck is loud, dude. What's up, Lazier Tommy? How we doing? Welcome back. I like your Moltres down there. Sure, why not? Let's try Let's try Cat Stevens. Let's see if that's something. I'll try and sing it. Climb up on the peace train. <clears throat> I'm good. How about you? I'm doing swell, Lazier Tommy. I'm actually feeling really good. And that's a very nice thing to, to say, because um, I've been very, very tired. Very, very tired with baby number two, but now I'm back. Now I'm back, baby! All right, let's see if I can find one that almost looks like music. My mother asks about Love by Nora Unahar from New Names for Lost Things as read by Cat Stevens. I don't want a peace train. I don't want a peace train. What did say? I want to tell you that love means I will be protected. Means what love is if not sheltering. Ama, it means I am seen. Means what love is if not present. Ma, it means I have a home address to breeze. Means what love is if not within. Cat Stevens. Chats in the clap, please. What should I guess, Lazier Tommy? What you got for me? Back to Chiptune. Maybe. What you got for me, Laser Tommy? While you're telling me, I'm going to pull up some Pocket Crystal League. Not Phuket. 
Pocket Crystal League, first playthrough. No back seating. No spoilers. I don't know if there are spoilers for this game, but I don't want them. No fan mail. Ha, I didn't really play on the Minecraft form anymore, so I gave my stuff to Splash and another guy. Oh, dope. Rock on. Is that Yeet? Did you give it to Yeet? Is that what Yeet was talking about the other day? Let's go for it. Um, where is it? There it is. All right, and I think it has pretty good bloopy music. It does, so I'm gonna turn off this. It does feel a little loud. Is it a little loud? Or is that just my speaker? Is that loud for y'all or just for me? I gave one guy everything in my inventory and the other one my base and everything in it. That's awesome. That's super generous. Good on ya. Alright. So here's what I've learned about this game. I played it some over the weekend. And I learned that it's very, very challenging. So we're gonna try our best. I honestly don't remember what deck I have. Because I have a mixed, I have a mixed deck. I'm honestly thinking about starting over. Because I don't know how stacked this deck is or not. I think I might start over. I'm going to start from scratch. All right, but we will go with the Bulbazar deck since we did that last time. Alright, payout. I'm going to start with the free cards. Uh, let's see. I have an Orin deck. That's pretty nice. A Wigglytuff? Yeah. Yeah, Wigglytuff this early on is really nice. Okay, dope. Now we got to build our deck. Dope. What was our best Gen 1 starter? Your dad blame right, Lazier Tommy. I agree with you, my friend. Um, let's start out by doing a, a level up of our first four. I think that sounds like a good idea. Starting off strong, dude. Do it. Do it to it. I can take down this guy. Easy peasy. Easy -dee peasy. -dee. Oh no, I don't have the updated version. Oh no! Do they do updates? I wonder if they do updates automatically. I wonder if I can just, I wonder if I can just pull an updated version. Rats. I can't believe I did that, man. I gotta update. The update has an attack all feature and it's so nice. I'm gonna have to find that. Yeah, let's look. Let's look. Let's look. Let's look. Worst case scenario, I can always just go re-download it because I'm telling you, it's nice. Let's see. Update. That's a big no. Ah, man. That's not my dad. That's just a cell phone. All right, well, I really want that attack all feature, so I'm going to go download it again. Is it playing music? All right, let's find it. This game is available on Itch.io, by the way, for free. If you like games and you like things that are free, I would highly advise you purchase it for free. Free is the best price, as they always say. Right there it comes again. Game cap. Nice, dude. All right, here we go again. Oh, oh no way! Oh, it kept it! Oh, that's wonderful. Thank you. I 
Thank you! That's so generous. That's a good game dev right there. That is a good game dev. Why is your Tommy? How's life treating you? Everything going going as it should. Rest of the chat, feel free to speak up as well. I'm happy to be back with you. We got a big week. Um, no stream on Thursday. I will be out of town for annual conference. For those of you that aren't in the methosphere, um, just uh, checking in, got a dip. All good, Lazy Tommy. Happy to have you around for the little bit that you could be. Enjoy a lurk. Um, I will not be around Thursday because of annual conference, which is basically a thing in the UMC. Man, he's already got glyphs. They know I'm good at this game. They know I'm the best. They know I want to be the very best like no one ever. So, I'll be at an annual conference all weekend. Thus, will not be able to stream. But I will be playing uh, Dungeons & Dragons with Trombone. So, you know, you take what you get. You take what you get. I like all these options. I guess I'll go with the free card. Mantine and Ponyta? Man, that's two good cards! I'm gonna go with the Mantine. At least it's a dual type. Beautiful. Let's battle. I wonder if it's because I leveled up so much, and that's why it's giving me grief. Easy. I mean, I got to the point that I lost so hard in this game, so I'm very happy to be starting off strong. Strong. There's one damage to me. Worth it. So good at this game, the greatest! The greatest gamer! Hmm. I need more cards. Nice, dude! That's a great pull. Holy moly. I could take any of these. So I'll take them all. Max out that deck, baby. I do think I need some glyphs this time. So I might cycle through the first round a couple times. We'll see. Nice. Easy enough. Of course, I'd pull out my level ones on the first go. So if I get a beefy card with a glyph, I can bring it in because I got that Enigma Berry. I'm not ready. I need another round. I'm not quite ready there. Either. I'm so into this game, dude. About the jewelry. I'm 
Any big plans for the week from anybody? Hopefully exclusively big, big plans. Love big plans. We had an incredibly boring weekend, and it was amazing. Anybody else out there love boring weekends? Just the more boring it can get, the better. I don't want to do a thing. Prison cards attack is lower by one. That's pretty nice. Money, 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 money. money. did, by the way, had a, have a wonderful play session with some Love Thy Nerd folks on Thursday. That was really nice. I think we ought to do more meetups like that. Love to see more meetups like that happen in the community. That was awesome. was like in my back the back of my head chancy chancy look at that chancy got six hp chancy ain't playing no games they can't hold a candle to me feels so good Or a free Diglett. Free Diglett's pretty nice. But I think Electabuzz has got to take it, dude. Oh, I maxed out, huh? Hmm. Take away. Hmm. I'll, I'll get to Adam in a I'd like to evolve while I'm down at this lower level. The only issue with that is if you want to call it an issue. Nice! It's so easy at the beginning. We're just gonna grind! Card is nice. Ooh, ooh, Cyndaquil. Gotta do it, baby. I think we could probably take her, take him. What is that? Oh, let's take him. Let's take him. Let's take him. Let's take him. This may be jumping the gun. You know, it just is what it is. It'll be nice to be able to bring the rest of our deck in, at the very least. Yikes. Did not go well. I wasn't ready. He wasn't ready. That also wasn't really a good hand. We'll go for another round. 
Why not? I could use some more berries. Two horns. If I can get a good lineup like that right from the get-go, I got this. Easy peasy. No problem. Too easy. Too easy, dude. That's how we do it. It got to the point with my game at home that I was just taking the payouts when it gave them to me. And when it didn't, I was just taking the damage and uh, resigning. It's really tough. Reaches a point where it just gets nigh impossible. Oh, we just gotta make the money. We got a pretty stacked deck right here, though. As long as we get the good cards out. Messed up. Come on, give me an evolution, dude. He's doing it on purpose now. Very often, I just can't do damage to a level two. Stressful one though. It was definitely a stressful one. We pulled it off in the end. Okay. They're really just not giving me an evolution, aren't they? It's not very nice. Almost messed up that time. I guess we'll try again. I haven't really changed anything. Maybe we'll have a better hand this time, though.
Oh, man. It's too late to make that. Rats! Alright, we just gotta overwhelm. Gotta overwhelm. Ah, oh, so close. Nice! Alright. Now things are changing. Thousand ninety one off the top, that's pretty good. We we really need some better cards, but we also really need evolution. I'm gonna worry about evolving before expanding. Couldn't have gotten much better there. Yikes. Didn't have the manpower. Don't have the manpower, which you can do. Alright. Probably go for the level ups. Just go down the line. Oh, Fooey, you know what? I should have worried about the level ones. I'm getting all the honey. Well, that's pretty rough. Pull. Weegee, would you want to help me? I'm going to teach you how to play the game. You want to be good at this game? You got to play it in my way. Weegee, I think I'm, I'm fine at this game, okay? Nuh uh. You keep losing. You're bad at the game. I'm not bad at the game. You're bad at the game. Accept it. I'm the greatest gamer, Weegee. Yeah, right. Did he just move that rock? Am I crazy or did he move that rock? I don't have both hands, trombone. I'm gonna make it so you can only redeem one of these at a time. Now you force me to make some kind of strange human centipede situation. This is demented. This is really messed up. I don't like it. I don't like it either, Ouija, but this was Trombone's choice. I don't like it at all. Yet! I know you don't like it either, Lon. You're the one really at the worst end of the bargain here, I guess. Oh, nobody's got it easy. Nobody's getting, getting good right now. Now somebody's going to be real confused if they walk in. Oh, I have all my berries out. 
didn't even notice that. I don't have a barracks. This might just be where we end. Lucky duck, lucky duck. We're lucky, aren't we? Yes, very lucky. Yet, yet, yet. yet. Hello. <laughs> Nothing, nothing strange to see here, is there, Lonk? No, nothing weird at all. Nothing strange is going on? Are you sure? Yeah, see you sure. What? That actually hurts my wrist to even hold them like that. Ouija, what are you doing up the top of the corner like that? Why are you just, like, chilling all weird and awkward up at the front? I am not weird. You're a little weird. Is there something on your head? No. Ouija, that is the literal definition of weird. You are a strange little man. Yikes! A magnet with glyphs? That ain't good. That ain't good. Is he gonna kill him next round? Does annual conference start Thursday morning or afternoon? I need to figure out when to arrive. The first session is at 3 o'clock, I do believe. 3 o'clock on Thursday, the clergy session. I don't know if you'll want to attend that or not. All of their rules. I never know. I never know who's supposed to go to what, when, and where, and how. Very challenging. Clean sweep, baby! Clean sweep, Ouija! We did it! Mwah! That was gross. Not kiss a puppet. Eating out the celebration. You're like my baby. You're like my little infant. What did the online schedule became more confused? Yeah, it doesn't get much easier. Does not get much easier. I'll play this until two and then I'll bust out Monster Sanctuary. Cool? Cool. It's fine with you, Ouija. It is fine. I will deal. Monster Sanctuary is a more developed game and actually made it onto the Switch. This game is just a fan game off Itch.io you found. I didn't find it, Jake found it. Same difference. It's not the same difference at all. It doesn't even mean anything. What you said doesn't even mean anything. It means everything. It means nothing. Give me evolution! Please! I beg of you. There it is, of course, after I spent all my monies. Wish I could take out a loan. I guess that's the game, isn't it? Alright, y'all have definitely been out five minutes. Go rest over there. I need more tea. is needed by me. This might be a clean sweep. If you didn't get somebody on the field. It's not enough. Do -do -do -do. Done, Done did, did it. it! Oh, I do have one more, don't I? Might as well take the last one. many levels are in this game? There are eight gym leaders to beach. Beat. Eight 
gym leaders. So. I have gotten to gym leader number four, and I could not win. Physically, could not win. ever get there? I do not know. Because it's a really challenging game. I think evolution is where I messed up in my personal game. I didn't evolve anything because I couldn't tell what the perk was. And I think that's where I made my mistake. I think I should have evolved. Time will tell. Well, not if I don't evolve anything, though. Clefairy! Clefairy! No! I could have had it! I think that might have been game even, dude. Did it anyway. Did it anyway. Very nice. Not quite at 500. Have I lost one other than to the gym leader? I was so amazed. I have not signed up for Patreon after being an avid content consumer for years now. And finally, finally, I have signed up for Patreon. And the people that made me do it, their names are Steve Zaragoza and Mike Felzone for their podcast, Dynamic Banter. It is my favorite. It is the only one that has ever broken me. I couldn't believe it. It's called Dynamic Banter. I don't know that I'd recommend it. It's very irreverent and random but I love them. They are my friends, but I do not know that I feel like I know because I have spent so much time with them. You know those kind of people? know that that was the right call what I just did, but it's definitely the call I made. Them's the facts. Come on, dude. This is tense, man. Is that it? Yes, dude! Yes! Feels good! Feels good! Ha <laughs> ha! Okay. I really need more cards. I'm starting to get... Can I even fight? Do I need 15 for the next one? No, I have just enough, but I really need more cards. I'm pushing my luck. I'd like to see a free card pop up. I haven't seen one of those in a little while. Oh, 
Oh, why did I not? Goofy goo. What's his perk? But it's such a weird situation. Do you have any podcasts like that or any shows that you watch that you're like, I can't really, like, recommend this show to anyone. But it's like my favorite thing that exists and I can't share it with anybody. It's a weird place to be in. It's a tricky choice. Choose to stalemate. It was the right choice, after all. It was Agatha all along. It was Westworld for me. I like the show, but it pushes the envelope for sure. That show was so gratuitous, man. They didn't need to do what they did. Attacks diagonally, do it sides twice instead of straight ahead, but base attack is halved. That'd be pretty nice to have. I feel like that would be a good one for a normal type, since they don't really counter anything. But who gets beefy? Mantine's pretty beefy. Let's go with Pidgey. Nate, did you notice me trying to recruit more people for Madari? I appreciate that. I appreciate you doing that. I My thing with Madari is that it just takes up too much time. I just simply, I simply do not have time for Madari. It ate away at my entire life for far too long. What? Oh, that's a really cool glyph. Oh man, that's a really cool glyph. I turned it down. I turned it down, but that was the hardest thing I've ever had to do. Especially considering time is of the essence right now. Only got another couple minutes of this game. That would have been so cool. But I wonder if it would have actually been as helpful as I think it is in my head. You know? Like in my brain space, it sounds really helpful. But in actuality, on paper, would it would it pay off? Who knows? Who could really say? Easy. Easy. Well, tribute card's nice, but I really haven't got many cards, have I? I'm trying so hard. I just gotta keep leveling them up. Having more cards isn't as helpful as having beefy cards. I can almost kill him. It would be nice to save him. Playing too much defense. I can't win just playing defense, dude. on that offense. Make it happen. With all my berries. Yes! 
Feels good, man. Okay, I could probably finish leveling him up, or at least level up a few more. need evolution to actually show up on a turn. But it never will. Why? Why, I ask? For what reason? Do they keep refusing that which I deserve. this. I am the greatest gamer. What does plus zero mean? That's a weird one. What does it do? Oh, yes! Oh, that would last for five turns, dude! <laughs> ha boom baby! Did he not attack? Did he not attack? He did, right? Hang on. We'll do it manually the next time. Yes. Yes, he did. Okay. I got worried there for a second. I was going to get frustrated. <sighs> Not what I need! Give me what I need! Charizard's pretty scary. Is it just type changes? What changes with evolution? I need to know! If it's just type changes, then it's absolutely not worth it. Oh man. So I'll, last, I'll last five rounds and I'll do damage on either side. Not worth it though, is it? So good at this game. We're making big money. Well then, I'm a bit of a tight spot. I saw these others some damage. Yes, trombone. I would I would rep it harder. I would rep it harder, but it just takes up so much of my life. It was too time consuming. Too addicting. The game is too good. It's two o'clock. It's two o'clock. Evolution, what a great way to end it. What a great way to end it. Come on. Still don't, still don't know what this does, though. 5, 3, 1. Let's see if anything changes. I can only evolve one. Are you yoking? Aww. Oh. No, that's sad. Consume berries return to hand if not full when fainting. Hmm. That's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. All right. We're going to play some Monster Sanctuary. I don't I know nothing about this game. 
But I do need to make more tea. So I'm going to make more tea. I'm going to turn on some chiptune real quick. Or I could always even throw you guys to a, to a be right back. But I, w I won't be gone that long. I'm literally stepping over here. Is the music going to play? Is music going to play? It's just very quiet. All right, tea time. All right, all right, all right, all right. That does not feel hot enough. That does not feel hot enough. But I have a keep warm feature on this thing, and I don't know if it works. Don't know if it works as it ought. Okay. Let's get into it. Let's play some Monster Sanctuary. See how this game goes. I would imagine it's full screen. I also had to play for five minutes with the controller upside down. Internet is super bad today, so apparently I was frozen and lagged while I was on mute and lurking. Sorry about that. Sorry back for a little bit now. You are all good. Perspectus, we appreciate you being here at all, my friend. It's a Team 17 game. Okay, Google, set a five-minute timer. Whoa, Why? Why is it this way? Why, why? Why such a big boy? I guess, oh no. Why, why? Better. Just remember I'm a professional gamer, guys. Okay. New game, obviously. New game timer. Oh, Neato. There's speedruns. Oh, I like the blue. Name my character. My character is difficult to do upside down. Check. Easy. The Monster Sanctuary is a land far from any other human civilization. While wild, wild, wild monsters wild, wild, are dangerous, dangerous to humans, dangerous. Monsters, monsters raised by them grow loyal to their owners. It me. Most of the people in Monster Sanctuary reside in the Keeper's Stronghold. Thank you. Many of them learn to raise and train monsters. They call, they call themselves, themselves monster, monster keepers. keepers. When do we return to Puzzle Girl? Whenever we want. Vote for it tomorrow. Girl, choose, choose the familiar, the familiar of your bloodline. bloodline. Okay, let's see. Spectral Wolf is pretty gnarly. Spectral Lion, Spectral Toad, Spectral Eagle. What are we feeling, folks? Water Wind, Fire Earth, Earth Water, ooh, Fire Wind. What are we feeling? I'll go with the first one I see in the chat. Wolf, eagle, toad, lion. Wolf, eagle, wolf, eagle. Wolf, eagle, toad, lion. Looks like lion's balanced. Toad is health and mana heavy. Spectral eagle's balanced with low defense. Spectral wolf is balanced with health mana. Lion says sneaky. That's what we'll do. Among the most prestigious monster keepers, there are four prominent bloodlines tied to the monster sanctuary's history. 
Each of these bloodlines is aided by a spectral familiar. Those familiars are ageless protectors of their family, passed on from one keeper to the next. Dope. Check is just starting out to become a monster keeper like her ancestors before her. I didn't know I was a lay girl. Did I have the choice? As with all starting monster keepers, their journey begins on the keeper's trail. Her bloodline's familiar bears the form of a spectral lion. Name your familiar. Alright, well, since he picked it, <laughs> lions. Lions! Since he picked it, we're gonna go with sneaky lions. What's up, Taco Dudes? How we doing? How's your week treating you? What is this? This is Monster Sanctuary. Walmart Pokemon, maybe. We'll find out. Although some people might say that Walmart, or some people might say Pokemon is the Walmart Pokemon. Yeah. Monsters are wild things. The only reason I'm helping you is the bond I share with your family. Most monsters are less inclined than me to help you. That is why you must always reside, raise your own monsters. They will grow alongside you just as I will, and they will fight for you. The best way to gain a monster's loyalty is to hatch it from its egg. Of course, you will have to fight to get those monster eggs. Nope. Initiate a fight by contact. We shall see if you live up to your ancestors. Ooh, nice. Choose monsters, retreat. Okay. Start obs. Ignite claws and stone rain. It really is Pokemon. Interesting. Not gonna lie, though. I kind of dig it. I kind of dig it, though. I'm not gonna lie. Smack. Um, this time just claws. It looks like uh, Terraria meets low budget Pokemon. Yeah. I don't know about low budget, man. Those, those, uh, those smoke, smoke fumes, plumes coming off the back of my line are pretty dope. There he goes. Victory! Rare loot chance, gold bonus. I got a blob egg! Nice. There we go, he received a blob egg. Now you need to hatch it. Open the inventory. Okay. Hatch it. I did it! I got a blob! A new best friend! His name is... Obviously... Walmart. Easy. Seems more like Terraria. Yeah. Yeah, I get that vibe. I get that vibe pretty heavily as well. I did it! That is your first monster you hatched by yourself. Right now it is weak, so you'll need to train it. There is much more for you to learn, too. You and that blob are quite alike. Let's continue on the Keeper's Trail. It will lead us to old Baron, an old friend of mine. He is a patient teacher to all young keepers who seek guidance. I advise you to listen to him very carefully. I want to be followed by Blog, not by Sassy Lion. Bleach isn't here, so I got to use all the emotes for him. That's right. I don't know where Bleach is. All right. Level one, level one. I don't know what any of those, I don't know what any of the things mean. Do I get to do both of them? Ooh, it's 2v2? Interessant. Okay. I think I can't type. You're all good. You're all good. No harm, no foul. I do the same thing. I get too excited. I get too excited and I forget words way too often. That's my real crisis. One down, one to go. Oh, 
Oh, we ran out of energy stuff. My purple bar. My little purple bar down there is gone. So what do I do? Do I just not go? Or does it regenerate each round? I can't do anything. Just regular attack. Interesting. Mod check. See, I didn't even know I could regular attack. I thought everything was a special attack. Very fun. Ooh, I didn't do very good. Based on the effectiveness of your combat strategy, you get a rating of 1 to 5 stars. Earning a higher rating increases your chances of getting better drops like rare monster eggs. 1800 player queue to get into the Lost Ark. Oh my goodness, I can't believe that game is still doing so well. That's exciting. I'm glad that it still has a wait list. Young Keeper, tis the Keeper's Trail's beginning. For all of man, Beast and Sanctuary has beginning. But it does not have spell check. Alright, weak... Weak to fire, weak to water. I am weak to wind. What's up, Toby? How we doing? How's life treating you? Okay, so let's see. What does this do? Oh, I see. That's literally just select them. Interesting. All right. I mean, let's just go for it, yeah? How's your Monday treating you, Chubby? Things going good? Doing well, just chilling. How are you? I'm doing good! I was saying earlier, this is the first time I feel like I've gotten rest, and that's a good thing. There was like a 9k player wait to get in, and then the game just crashed once you were in from all the AIs in one spot. Goodness gracious. I remember back at the very, very beginning, it was like you had to wait days. So crazy. He's weak to fire, so I need to do it in night. Easy! Tea is done. Go ahead and get the tea bag out here. Let's see if I did any better that round. Yeah! Three stars! I got a potato. That's a thing that makes sense in a Pokemon clone. As your monsters gain experience in combat, they will increase in level. This allows them to gain new skills. You should take a look at the skill tree menu. There's a skill tree. Did he just blow bubbles? All right, skills. Got one skill point for sneaky lions. So I could increase... Any of these three things, I imagine, or is it just the one? Just the one. I kind of like Stone Rain. Yeah, baby, let's do attack. Give me a beef, beefy boy. I can't believe you can just blow bubbles anytime I want him to. It's amazing. This game's the greatest game ever made. Find me a better game. You can't, Taco Dudes. You can't find me a better game because you can't blow bubbles in just any game. I found Cestus. Hello there, friend. Hey, friend, you're just starting as a monster keeper, right? Did you find some equipment for your monsters already? You can make your monster stronger by equipping them. I can give them that Cestus thing? I can give my little bubble guy Kunai? Stop. Naruto? Walmart Naruto? Oh, we're a fan. We are a fan. We are a fan. Naruto. Wow, look at Naruto get. Amazing. This game has, has the most crossovers ever. When I was playing Dead Cells the other day and I got the... um the nail from Hollow Knight. 
Hey, fellow Keeper, did you know that every single of your monsters possesses a special ability? Some can be used to get rid of certain obstacles. Also, you might encounter some destructible walls like the one behind me. Go on and try and hit it with some of your monsters' abilities. <gasps> Didn't do it. Yeah! I got a vital ring. Oh, I bet I can equip that. Oh, yes. Watch me equip. Yeah! They ain't even gonna know what to do with all my health. How do I get up here, though, is the question. Have I just not got the skills? How do I get up here? Do I need something that can fly? Can I jump on the bubbles? <laughs> okay, I guess I can't get that. That's a bummer. Maybe I can have Bird Friend? Maybe Bird Friend can fly me over there? Bird friend! All right, bird friend, let's see what you're weak to. You are weak to wind? Okay, I don't think I have any of that. You're weak to whatever that is, light. I don't know what that is. Ground, earth. But I do have stone rain. Goodbye, bird. Pretty sure I love this game. I wish he threw the kunai. How amazing would that be? I wonder if he does. Four stars! I'm getting better and better. I got a Vero egg! Ooh. We got another egg. I gotta hatch an egg. Bird friend? Bird friend! All right, what's bird friend's name? Is it just Bird Friend? I think I, I think I'm thinking Bird Friend. No, not all caps. Bird. Oh nope. Bird Friend. Nice. Pidgey. Pidgey would have been a good name. Pidgey would have been a good name. All right, skill points. I got skill points to distribute. Beating. <laughs> what? <laughs> What a move! Um, this bird beats, actually. Uh, let's see. Wind, wind, wind. Neutral, neutral. I want wind move. Birds aren't real. The birds work for the bourgeoisie. Uh, let's see. Slime shot. Ooh! Gotta learn the move. So I only get four moves. That's what I'm understanding now. Fascinating. Do I have any other equipment that I can dole out? No. The little innocent bird can brutally beat his opponents. Gnarly, dude. Levitates the player. I knew it, dude. I knew it. <laughs> the greatest game I've ever played. I love this so much. Okay, I got to hide. An accessory. 12 defense, 12 or 110 health. Oh, my goodness. I'm all about this game. Give it to bird friend. Bird friend is bird friend beats and wears the wears the hide of his enemies. He wears the skin of his near dwells. Bird friend don't mess around, dude. Man prospered through generations, founded cities and nations, connected by dirt and wheel, and later by steam and steel. Bird friend, I'm sorry. What was that now? What was that up there though? Didn't care for what I just saw. Whatever that was. Didn't, oh, it ran away. Did you see it? It ran away. It didn't, it didn't trust me. This is a little dark. All right. Whoops, too far. I got mad hops, dude. Gauntlet. Defense. All right, where are we going now? What is this saying? Right is the stronghold, left is the trail. Let's go check out the stronghold. Maybe we can buy some things. This is the path to the Keeper's stronghold. We should continue on the Keeper's trail and visit Old Baron. You're right. What's down, though? Bird friends! Three? Three bird friends? That's too many bird friends. Yes. Yes! So 
Sorry, been AFK. This is Terraria plus Pokemon plus Dragon Quest and OG Final Fantasy. It's dope, whatever it is. This bird beats things. Oh no, that's okay. That's a wrong typing. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Gnarly. Just gnarly birds. So I didn't see that it threw predictors, but that's nice to know. I've actually been wanting to play Terraria again. I'm on this weird kick where I'm wanting to play every game again. I'm wanting to play old games. Games that feel familiar. Do you ever get on a kick like that? We just want to play old games. Yes! So beefy! Good job, bird friend! Well, there was no echo on that. We didn't like that. We don't like when there's no echo. Alright, finish this. Finish this, bird friend. See what our score was. Victory! Come on, four stars, baby! Alright, no new eggs. That's fine, though. Terraria makes me think of Buchanan, and I need to see what's going on with him. Yeah, I haven't heard from Buchanan in a while. Unfortunately, we just haven't had the time to do, um, to finish up Animon's story. We've got to. Man knew of those who wait in the woods and caverns beyond, yet for the treasures within he longed, for the greed of kings was great. Don't call me greedy. Bird friend! Diadem. What was that? 10 defense mana. We're gonna get mana to Sneaky Lions. I love this game, and I can't believe I've not played it before. Fight me! I got wind. Does wind do anything for any of you guys? It sure does not. And my arcane is neutral. But I do have kunai. So I can always just whack you with my kunai. That's also fine. I wish he threw him, dude. I wish he threw the tiny little kunai. Wouldn't that be the, the greatest thing? It's buff. Lost Ark story makes zero sense right now. Have they added new things? Or are you, like, waiting for new things to be added, and that's why it doesn't make sense right now? We gotta get more types in here. I'm in the middle currently, gotcha. Haven't finished it yet. I remember H-Man really enjoyed the story. It didn't It didn't exactly grip me quite yet, whenever I started playing it. Didn't, didn't do anything for me yet. Doesn't mean that it would never get there. Just means it wasn't there. Yet. Well, that'll finish him. How would the... How would bird person... Okay, whatever. It's fine, dude. I'm fighting with half-demons to kill priests who are fighting with sometimes demons to find something to kill demons. That makes, you know, some sense. It's a power of friendship, dude. It's just a power of friendship. Easy. Power of friendship. The friends we made all along the way. I don't know if healing increases my like score, if it shows that I have like a wide use of my characters. Thing is that the demons uh, also are trying to get the thing that kills the demons. I don't know. I know nothing. Magma pillar. Don't mind if I magma do. Yes. When do they evolve? In honor of our good friend Buchanan. We'll name this one Buchanan. I 
That guy's a grub four. I always see, I always see your notes a little too late. All right, let's see, I got a walnut potato. Oh, it's a consumable, like a one-time thing. Interesting. There's upgrade materials. What? Mana ring. I wonder, can four be out at a time? Surely not, right? Fire claws. Bird person looks like he needs some mana. Beat that mana up. I can feed him the things now. What? How long does they? How long do they last? I have so many questions. How long does that health last? Forever? I'm just so curious. There's so much I know and so much I don't. Two? Two treasure boxes? An orb and a morning star? <laughs> Who wants to hold the morning star, dude? Bird friend, do you want a morning star, bro? That's pretty gnarly. <laughs> I love bird friend. Bird friend plays no games, dude. Bird friend is not here to play games. He is wearing the hide of his enemy. All right. Let's see what we got going on here. Leaves are not strong to anybody. So we'll just do arcane. Maybe we shouldn't. Maybe I should switch him out with uh, the cannon. Yeah. Okay. Easy. Shoot. Well, I guess I should have done might first, huh? Always next round. I wonder what Magma Pillar does for me, huh? By the way, the little thing in the center is definitely something from Omori. That is 100% an Omori sprout. And I cannot be convinced otherwise. Oh no, does it only do one? Okay, good. I was about to say. If it only was one, that would have been a big bummer. Got no, nothing on me. Keep on beefing. Keep on beefing. Okay, there's nothing I can do that'll kill in this round. Unless I get lucky and crit. Oh my goodness. The greatest. Gamer. Ooh, two skill points. I don't feel, I don't know how they want me to do better. Acid rain. Gotta learn all those moves. I want all the moves before I start enhancing them. Man plunged into deepest abyss, foraged, attacked, and slew. These endeavors were without solace. The cost on humanity, nobody knew. This really is getting very, very dark, Taco. I'm on, I'm on your side. I think we're... We're taking a plunge into the darker side. Ooh, I bet Magma Pillar can take that down. And I was right. 
Bam! Burn those vines. Cat! Cat with sword! Bam! Cat Zerker! Yes? You called. He's weak to this. Yes! First round, he didn't get a chance to touch me, man. I hope I get a cat circer. I really want him to be my friend. I think he'd like to be my friend, too. Just a vibe I'm getting. What? Just got a scratch-off ticket ad? Is this legal? <laughs> no. Call the authorities. They're not even allowed to show you a scratch-off ticket. In fact, you're not allowed to see one. I hope you closed your eyes because they could technically... Call the authorities. Just for you having seen it. Cat Zerker! Yes! Hatch that Cat Zerker. Yes. Yes. Ooh. I love him so much. I'm going to name him Titus. Also known as Titus. Because this is Final Fantasy. And you can't tell me that it isn't. So there are more moves eventually. Interesting. So much to know. So many things to be known. Still haven't figured out when consumables go away. Come at me. All right, let's see. They're all weak to water, and I don't think I have anybody that has anything to water. What? What? Oh, I see. I obviously want Bird Friend. Then I think I want Titus. And I think I want Walmart. Might. Nope, I was wrong. Wasn't wrong there, though. Dude, I love Cat Zerker. He's so cute. Let's see. I don't honestly remember what their moves are. and get him out of the way. One down, two to go. Yeah, I didn't have anything. Rats! I clearly gotta learn my, my monster's moves, that's for sure. Got him. Nope. Nice. Man, 
It's just tough to be so good at games, you know? Only two stars. Are you kidding me? Bogus. Find me somebody that could have done that better. You can't. They don't exist. Ooh, for realsies? That's pretty cool. I love that. Buff and regeneration. Or get a stronger shield. I think I like the regeneration one. Doop -doop 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 -doop. Bow. Crit ring. Who deserves it? Probably Titus. Alright, we got a blob, a cat circer, and a blob. Right, well, I know that I need Grass Boy then. Some with a grass move, which Walmart definitely has. And then I need somebody with light moves, and I don't know who has those. Start with might. Always get beefed first. Then we need grass for Cat Zerker. Nice. No, don't heal. Kind of wish it didn't have to show the animation every time, you know. Marie. This is a game of pretty fun. This is a game of good time. I like it, this game. It's a good game. You like this game, Mario? I didn't know you were into the turn-based thing. Oh, sure, sure, yeah. Yeah, you like the Super Mario RPG, right? Yes. And then the Mario and Luigi games. They were good games. They were good games. They were definitely good games, Marie. Yes. A very good games. I already say it. Why you say it too? That's a called a redundancy. It is redundant whenever I repeat what you say, but sometimes that's what I do whenever I um whenever I improvise a puppet's voice. And that is the dumb thing to do. It is dumb. It is dumb. That's not a good idea. You're right. Yes, four stars. Yes, blob egg. What happens whenever I get two blobs? Can I combine blobs? What do you think that means? What does it mean to have another blob? What do you think it means to have another blob? What does this mean? What does this mean? What does this mean? Now I just have two blobs. What am I supposed to do about this? You got the same moves. Should we make this one just healing blob? You like that? 
You like that plan, Marie? We'll make this the healing blob. I can get behind that. Pretty good plan. I cannot believe beating is a move. That's just so strange. What are you gonna do now? I don't know. I don't know what's next. I don't know if I need bubble burst. How evenly distributed should the blob be? That's kind of nice. I'm sure that we have mana no matter what. I don't have to worry about healing anymore. That's nice. But then came the four, free from the greed of any other sin, who listened to the voice within, struck a wound to the realm's core. But the what does he need this me? Oh no, that was a close one. It was close, that was really close. Especially since I don't have my controller since you're with me, Marie. You know, you're not, you're not convenient. And I think that's why they always redeem you. It is, it is why, yes. Well, I'm gonna have to put you down in order to do this kind of um, acrobatics work that I'm doing here. I think I need bird person, bird friend, excuse me. Definitely not, definitely not bird person. Definitely not copyrightable bird person. Ooh, I wonder what the cat says. <gasps> Breaks hidden walls, that's not that fun. Activates fire orbs. Water orbs. So many things. So many things that I don't get to know. I don't know how to activate them. Is it maybe... I don't want to just start pressing buttons, dude. Z, X, Q. I don't want to tab. Shift. Control. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, Mario. I'm t I'm t I, don't I don't feel very comfortable just pushing buttons, you know? All right, Marie, you're just going down. Goodbye, buddy. Okay. Done did it, done did it. Smoke bombs. Like you do. <laughs> Super buff walrus boy. Yowie. I love Yowie. All right, well, I have Fire Friend, I have Grass Friend, and I have Might Friend. Start combat. Let's go ahead and get Might on the board. What is Sorcerer? So now I can, oh, it just unlocked another move. I thought it was like a passive, like when you do this, it also does that. We're learning. We're learning. Every step of the way, we are learning something new. Nice. Ice hail. Tell me that's not a Digimon, dude. Tell me that's not a Digimon. You legally cannot tell me that's not a Digimon. That simply is a Digimon. It simply is. There's no other way of seeing it other than Digimon. I'm not a Digimon. Yowie Yowie Buster. Buster. Actually, that's not a very good thing to say, is it? Y-O-W-I-E means something very different from another interpretation of that word. Okay. Anybody else know fire moves? I don't think so. Zeltar can be out for the fight. I think so much. 
Thank you for redeeming me. Even though Nathan has no voice for me, he really appreciates you redeeming this this puppet. This absolutely pointless puppet that no one knows how to voice. We really appreciate it. Because Nathan doesn't really have a girl voice. He doesn't really do a girl voice. He just doesn't. He never has, never will. He tries his best, but it's really not very good. Even in video games, where he reads off the lines of characters, he just kind of gives them his own voice, but slightly softer. And in a way, that's kind of a stereotype, because not all women have soft voices. You should kind of be ashamed of yourself. Not ashamed. So what am I supposed to do with the multiple characters? Can I not, like, combine them or something? I need to know! Tell me the truth! Ooh. A tome. And potions. Nice, so we need to do explore. I love maps like that, you guys. I love mini maps. Big fan. Big fan. Whoopsie. <laughs> it is not easy. It is not easy. I thought it was A. I want to go the other way. <laughs> ah! Ah, Zeldar! Workout oh, with just my pinky and forefinger. It's not easy. He make it look easy, but it is not easy. Shell, thank you. My shell accessory. These are things that go together well. My Michelle accessory. From this womb, rivers flowed, and mountains grew mighty and cold. Tis the only place for any creature that lives in peace with its nature. Have a good time at work. See you, trombone. Appreciate you hanging out with us and all your puppet redemptions, as always. Okay, what what should I get to original Walmart? A little health, health boost. Give bird friend a little defense boost. Sneaky lions. Keep on buffing that mana. Just wooden sticks, huh? Schmack! All right, we got, let's see, fire, grass, and fire. So, might, fire, grass. Don't know what that means. Don't know what they just gave themselves. Don't know what they just gave themselves. Literally no clue. All right, bird friend. I'm going to switch you out for somebody with a fire move. Not doing as much damage as I need it to, to be quite honest. Why did that do so much fire damage? Take him out of one fell swoop next round, no matter what. I think we will anyway, but just in case. Better safe than sorry. Yeah, we did it. 
Thor Love and Thunder tickets opened up today. Have you seen the latest poster for that? That is wild looking. What's up, Steven? Welcome to stream. We're playing not Pokemon. But somehow something I'm enjoying maybe more? Yowie. Anything else. Literally any other name other than Yowie. Um, I'm going to name it not, not, what was the Digimon, what was the Digimon's name? That was the Walrus. It was Joe's Digimon. Let's look it up. I got to know. Joe's Digimon. Gomamon was its original. What did it evolve into? Where's Gomamon? There's Gomamon. Gomamon did evolves to Ikakumon. That's who it was, wasn't it? <laughs> yes, yes, Ikakumon. Let's do it. We'll be very clear. Not Pokemon. This one's going to be Ikakuman. Not Ikakuman. Which I don't even know if I'll have enough letters. Steven, how's your Monday treating you? Nice. It fit. Now, my team is too big. I think we can agree on this. So I, gotta, I guess I'm going to trade out what does this mean. Oh no. With Naughty Kakuman. Working while enjoying the stream. Nice. We're glad you're here. Appreciate you hanging out with us today. Ooh, I can get up there. Is there like, a, is there like one that can make me jump super high? No, I just go up there like that. Time to fly! Oh, I do! Something's gonna make me jump eventually. What do you do, Naughty Kakuman? Just move heavy blocks, okay. Not helpful. Dope. Dude, all I've ever wanted from Pokemon was for them to let me interact with overworld characters, and this lets me do that, and that makes me really happy. Ooh, if it isn't an old friend of mine. Hey, Bron, long time no see. I've brought you a new student. She just hatched her first monsters. I thought you might teach her some lessons. Oh, you've got a new spectral keeper, huh? Folks call me Oberon. I've made my home at the end of the keeper's trail so I can teach all of you greenhorns about your new duties as fully-fledged monster keepers. But first, let's battle to see if we're worthy of the title. <laughs> I always love games like this, man. First thing you have to do is fight me. Always observe your enemies carefully. Some say that the outcome of battle is decided before it begins. Since I raised those blobs myself, they are stronger than the ones you've seen so far. As you can see, their level is much higher. You can also see the weaknesses and resistances of your enemies. My blobs are weak to win attacks. All right, I'll just start with this this crew. That is very nice to know. Though. I'm going to start with some might. Lurking, all good. Thanks for the lurk. Appreciate you. Look at the top right corner of the screen, that's the combo counter. Every action you do in combat will increase the combo counter based on how often you hit your enemies or heal to buff your allies. This will increase the damage of the following attacks. The combo counter resets after every turn. So it makes sense to always try to act with your weaker, defensive, or assisting monsters first and use high hit counter actions. This will maximize the damage of your offensive monsters that attack later. That is very helpful to know, as a matter of fact. Some might even call that the most helpful thing you've ever said. I wish I'd known that earlier, as a matter of fact. Well, I guess we'll just go with a, with a classic. Hope for some crit. So there's more to this battle mechanic than meets the eye. At first I thought it was real basic, but I think it's actually quite good. You don't have any wins, so we don't really need you. 
We need somebody with wind. Which I don't know who has one, but... I don't know what the little... I don't know what the bottom symbol means. Let's see what Titus has. Let's have you cast Regeneration. That'll get us a nice little combo. c c, -c combo Easy. Easy peasy. Alright. Good, he did, he did, he did, he did. Okay, perfect. So now we just gotta figure out what can you do? Probably nothing. Let's switch you out with uh, Buchanan had a shield and stuff, right? Come back. Nice. Oberon's got nothing to treat me. Is Oberon a play on Oberon? What do we think? Old Baron. Gotta be, right? Sustain and shield. Yes! No, don't heal. Yeah, and this game's actually very, very good. I wasn't expecting this game to be so good. And it stacks, dude! That's very nice. Sprites, mwah. Three stars. You're full of it. Not bad, not bad at all. You have walked the Creeper's Trail and you defeated my monsters. However, to become a proper Monster Keeper, you need to complete one more test. Young Keeper, the next test will be much more challenging. You should prepare for it first. If your monsters have any free skill points, use them now and use them wisely. I mean, I would love to, but I'd also love to know... Do I need to go explore? Is it going to, like, lock me out from this area? Because there were definitely more areas that I wanted to look at. I don't know if I have any with a water move yet, so I'm going to take that. Bird person's pretty dope. And that air sickle is real cool. I want to know what this doozy of a challenge this guy's about to give me is. I feel like there's so much more to explore. I'm going to go explore more because I don't know what he's about to do. But I'm not interested in being locked off from this area. If it's going to lock me off, I'm not interested. By the way, this game is available in Game Pass. So I'm playing it in Steam because I like to get all of my achievements. Hmm. Well, hmm. I don't think I can go that way. That's my That's my hunch. Call it a giz. Call it a little bit of a giz, but I don't think I can go in there. That implies that I can come back here, doesn't it? All right, let's see what we got. Grass and water. Grass and water. Let's see. First, we got to start off with might, of course. Then grass, and I think he has water as well, doesn't he? Who did I just give water to? I'm pretty sure it was him. 
Let's go with Buchanan. Beef him up first, dude. Might. We love it. Easy. Easy choose. I'm ready for a move that attacks more than one at a time. I wonder when or if that comes into play. Finish him, dude. Smack! Who else has a grass move? I really can't remember. Let's try Naughty Kakumon. Definitely should have done the shield first because that gave me the combo boost. Hardy Kakumon, let's see what you got, buddy. Water. Nope. No luck. But you can finish this with a tackle. Oh, yeah! Big strong. Me big, me strong. Ikakumon. Action Ninja, what's up? Oh, my goodness. Thank you for the raid. What's, what's up, Raiders? Up, Raiders? How are we doing? doing? What's good, Quiz King and Chovy? Thanks so much, Action Ninja. Raid. Get raided. Dragonheart coming in with the emo spam. We love to see it. Ukulele for worship, Sis Pineapple. How are we doing, folks? Happy Monday. Happy Monday. This is a wonderful surprise. What y'all been up to? What were you doing over on your stream? First question, what were y'all doing on your stream? Second question, have you ever played this game? Because I'm real into it. Monster Sanctuary. Sup, indeed. What were y'all up to? Playing anything or doing it just chatting? Welcome, everyone. Doing good. Just hopefully I can remember to try to contact my friend. I've always known him as Brett, even though I know it's not his real name. Got you. Got you, got you. Yep, check out the Discord if you're not already in there. we got a super active Discord. Always things going on over there. Especially if you like anime. Um, poor Trombone Dalek. Some of you may know her. You definitely want to help her out. She plays a card collecting game called Madari over in the Discord, and she has no one playing it with her, and so somebody needs to join her. So if you know Trombone Dalek and you feel compelled to be her friend, that would be a really nice thing to do. Wizard Hat gives me extra mana and defense. Let's do it. What I was doing... Love, rage, peace, rage, rage, cry, cry. That's what you were up to. He's a friend I've had for a very long time. He paid for my computer after he trashed my old one, according to him at least. But for all I know, he just trashed it. Just didn't have an excuse to buy me a better one. Well, that would be a very, a very kind thing to do. Sneaky but kind. Sneaky but kind. Which is fine. Oh, you can't activate fire? Okay. You can. Smack. Oh, yes! Pandora's box! Oh no! You guys, you, you raided and you you made me open Pandora's box. Defense plus 12, receive a random buff at the start of combat. The monster can still receive another instance of buff normally. What? That's dope! Y'all made me open Pandora's box. Same friend who brought me a $10,000 pool for a three-year-old son while expecting a second child and didn't think of any of it. That's very kind. Gotta find them, gotta thank them. 
We have a three-year-old, and I can't even imagine the pool right now. Cannot even imagine. Let's see if I can reach that flying spot. I don't think I can. Nope, not a chance. Pandora's box is about right. We had a lot of chaos that needed to go somewhere. May as well bring it here. Well, I appreciate you bringing it here. I appreciate the raid. Appreciate y'all hanging out with us for a little bit. Feel free to give us a follow. We're on the road to 1K. If you don't already follow Checkpoint Church, we'd love to see you around more often. We have a lot of fun. VR stream set up for the last week plus when I launched it today. Didn't work like at all. And now I'm sad, defeated, and dejected. Oh, that's awful. The thing is, VR is so fickle. It's very, very fickle. But I'm sorry that it didn't end up working out for you. That's a big bummer. That's a big sad for sure. I wonder if Bird could take me all the way. Bird! Nope. Too far for Bird to fly. Okay, let's see. All waters. I don't know who else knows a water move, but I'm going to bring Buchanan. Start with Might. I still want moves that'll attack all of them at once. VR is brutal. Yeah, I'm bummed. It's a bit of a leap for my old rig, but I really thought I'd tweaked enough. Oh well, I have to play one of my other zillion games, right? Right? There's so many games. There's truthfully just too many games. Just too many games out there. That's why this game's been on my backlog for like forever. And I finally was like, I just gotta do it. I just gotta do it. Recent years, he's coming into a lot of money where he can make $10,000 a day or more and he gets paid weekly. Oh my goodness. Sounds like a great friend to have. Especially if they're generous with it and kind, which it sounds like they are. All right, let's see. Nice. Easy. Your stream setup looks pretty rad, man. Loving the purple, especially the matching purple halo in the camera. Right? Yeah. Got our little logo and Flowey the flower back there. Flowey's holding things down. He's kind. He's kind back there. And Aura. Yeah, we don't even cause it. It just happens. It's just, it's just transcendent, truly. Got our little faux neon back there. Get the neon look without the neon buzz. We're working on it. I, I'm wanting to entirely break down all of my OBS and do everything again. <laughs> Just do all of it over because it all irritates me. I set it all up whenever I was very, very beginning and now I feel like we've come so far. So much has changed. I've learned so much that I want to destroy it all and build it from the ground up. But that also is a lot of work. I usually don't ask him for help myself, but Ninja could use a new computer, so I might be trying to contact him at some point to see if maybe I could take some of the money and give a monstrous computer to Ninja. That'd be a way to pay it forward. Absolutely a way to pay it forward. Four stars. No eggs, though. Never ends, does it? I literally have to stop myself from doing that so I can do other more important things. Super fun to play with the overlays and stream doodads, though. Yeah, I try. I try. I try. I try. But it does. It takes its it takes its toll and it takes its time. Support. I don't know what sidekick is. So many buffs. So many skill trees, so little time. Ooh, heal. We like to see that. Right, let's see. He's already got all his moves. Yeah. Icy skin. He is just a Kakuman, dude. That's hilarious. Ooh, I can make him beefy and it would redirect. That's pretty nice. Channel and glory. Man, so this guy's supposed to be your beefy. Your tank. Your tank here. Gotcha. Thank you for your lurk, Extra Ninja. Appreciate you with the raid. Appreciate you hanging out. Later indeed. Good luck. Hopefully all the all the VR stuff gets figured out. Wish you luck on your stream for sure. Let's go. 
let's go for um, glory cast. I feel like there's too many options in this game. Too many options. Really do appreciate the read though, raid, though. Whoa! Phoenix tier. What are you looking at? Hello, young monster keeper. Your first time on the keeper's trail, is it? This is a teleporter stone. You can use it to travel quickly to other teleporters you find. Me? I'm just a treasure hunter. I make a business selling the things I find here and there. Want to buy something? Obron? Obron, you can find him heading further west. Okay, what do you buy? What can I buy from you? Sustain ring, a shell, a phoenix tier. Man, am I eventually going to start using potions and stuff? <gasps> yes, sell all sticks. Man, this game's about to get real interesting. I just have a feeling. Hello, fellow keeper. Did you know that you can change which of your po monsters are following around? I almost got a Pokemon! <laughs> I was this close! I was this close to calling him Pokemon! Planning to go through the guy who built Love Thy Nerds computers in the coming months. Later. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Was that you saying goodbye, Chevy? Are you peacing out as well? I want to see I want to see the cat. Cussie Divine. Yes! Gnarly! I love it. I love it so much. Regarding VR, to quote old Ron from Jaws, I'm going to need a bigger boat. Yep. Gonna need a bigger rig. No, saying later to XG, I'm still here. Oh, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Boom, boom, boom. Noise! Might first. Sustain. Yes! Almost, almost able to take him down in one hit. Well, for those of you that are not used to Checkpoint Church, every Monday we try to do something um, Pokemon oriented. So this is our Pokemon Day's substitute for today, Monster Sanctuary. I gotta be real. I'm enjoying it a whole heck of a lot. I believe this will be one that I will be checking out. I might even download it on Game Pass so I can play on my phone as well. So I just got, so I have, a, I have a Samsung Ultra, the new 22 Ultra. And whenever I put the case on it, it becomes too long for the like backbone controller that I got. So I got a game, sir, not a backbone, but they're virtually identical. And it's, it's literally like a 1 16th of an inch too long. And I don't know what to do about it. I'm kind of just in a, in a tough spot. My friend bought two Ryzen Epics, which I have no clue how he got, but that's his business. Then he got me two 3090s at scalper prices like they were bars of chocolate and way too much RAM along with a very healthy amount of storage. That's dope. Pocket Monster Sanctuary, that's right. They can try to call it Monster Sanctuary, but I will make it Pocket Monster Sanctuary. Bandana! Just stand down the edge of your Samsung phone. Can't imagine that hurt anything. So no joke, what I've considered doing is there's a rubber footy that holds in the phone and I've thought about taking that out but then I'm scared it's going to make it not hold the phone and then, I, and then I'm, you know back in the same place I was because now it doesn't work now I've got something that doesn't work but if I take the phone out of the case it works like a charm like an absolute charm so you see my conundrum I'm truthfully just, I'm, I'm in between a, a rock and a hard place That I do. I don't know. I don't know what we'll do. I'll figure something out. Either I'll just take the case off every time, but then I'm worried, like, just taking your case off too much is that going to, like, wear down the buttons or something? I don't know. Because it's a pretty good case. It's a good size case, too. So I was like, maybe if I order another case, that'll be thinner. But I don't think so. I don't think the case will make a difference. It might. 
And I guess worst case scenario, I just order it and then send it back if it doesn't, you know? That's probably the right answer. It's probably what I should do. We're being real. It's a predicament. It's a predicament. A real predicament. Main downside to uh, my monster, monster of a PC is that there's no power supplies that are big enough for it, so I ended up with two power supplies on top, one sitting on top of the case. Gotcha. I do all pre-built. I, I really, it overwhelms me so much to even consider opening up a computer and changing anything. But I just did a pre-built omen. Gives me anxiety. Gives me severe anxiety to even consider opening up a computer. I remember if I told Bleach that, Bleach was like, dude, just, I'll, I'll you know, come help you. It's no problem. And I was like, no, you don't understand. The anxiety would exist whether it was my hands or somebody else's hands. I need to not be physically in the room whenever it's happening. I need to be physically outside of the space or else I'll be incredibly uncomfortable. I have to leave the area. I mean, I think the power supplies have come back in stock since that was like height of the scalpers when he bought all the stuff for this. BRB, hope I don't miss you when I come back. Shouldn't be too long. We'll be on here till four. We'll be on here till four. Another 40 minutes. 40 minutos. It's the game plan. Regardless, though, appreciate the lurk and time. Smack, smack, smack. I can take down this one at least. I'm out of tea. I'm out of tea. It's no bueno. I need more. Sugar water. That's funny, my magma guy got burnt. Man, I tell you, this game gives you so much time before you even do the initial stop. Like, I feel like I could grind forever. Known him before he got rich. If I didn't know him before I got rich, then I probably wouldn't have the PC I do today. Rocky! <gasps> Who's Rocky? Who is Rocky? Have I seen Rocky? <gasps> That's Rocky. Well, he's obviously Omori. Hikikomori! One of these days we're going to finish that game, I promise. Do I keep my starter? I kind of want Sprout. I guess not. I'm conflicted now. All right, grass, grass, grass. Who knows grass moves? You do. I think that. I think I think that's it. Do you know grass? You might know grass. Might. Oh my gosh, you guys, I was crying, crying, laughing the other day at a TikTok of this girl that recreates the sound of the road crossing person saying, wait. And it was so good that I had tears streaming down my face. I need to share it in the Discord. Because, I mean, I was actually crying, weeping. That's what TikTok does to me. TikTok, TikTok makes me cry laughing at just nonsense things. They don't even make any sense. But they're just so funny. 
I need more tea. I keep going to reach for my tea, and I'm like, I don't have it. I don't have any more tea. Well, Dragonheart, that definitely sounds like a tough choice. Definitely sounds like you got a tough choice on your hand. I hate to hear it. But, I mean, it sounds like this is a generous person. I'm sure they would be. I'm sure they would be tickled to be given the opportunity to be generous in that way. I think. From the sounds of it. I went to a um, very bougie, very well-to-do uh, university for my undergrad, and I am not bougie and well-to-do. And I, um, I learned that about people that are, that are in that situation, is that they typically are quite generous people. Typically. Not gonna say everybody. Tough choice, I didn't know it was tough. I mean, he's still my friend. He knows I don't normally ask for stuff for myself. I usually ask for something for others because I can make a comfortable living just how I am, but I use resources to help others. Exactly. Exactly. So it's not really a tough choice, just kind of a, a, a position that not many people find themselves in. Do I ever, yeah, I use that actually a lot, don't I? Interesting. It didn't unlock any of those? Fascinating. So I haven't used channel a single time with him, have I? Yes. Yes! I think the tougher thing is going to be trying to figure out how or if I can get this PC from the U.S. to Canada where Ninja is without serious damage. Oh, yeah. They, I'll tell you, they wrap those things up real tight. They do an excellent job. Whenever I ordered my Omen, it was very impressive to me how good of condition it was. Just don't go through FedEx. Which I guess they wouldn't, right? Because you're going over, over a border. find that anytime I order something from overseas or across a border, it's always through like a third party, through like a company I've never even heard of. Aw, I really thought I'd make it. No falling damage at least. It's nice to know. Ooh, can I teleport? Is that teleport crystal relevant to me yet? No, I guess not. Well, I think we've actually done a little bit of grinding. So maybe we'll be extra tough. for old Baron. It's definitely an Oberon pun, right? It's gotta be. I'm building it myself because it's cheaper to build it yourself. If you can, that means I'm the one who has to be packing it and never had to pack a PC, especially for cross-border. Understood. Now I'm putting it all together. Yeah, you're in a tough spot. <laughs> that does sound... I'm telling you, I'm so nervous whenever it comes to PCs and stuff that that would absolutely... I'd be having shaky fingers for days. But I believe in you. I believe in you. I believe in the me that believes in you. Creates a rock obstacle. Do 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 rock obstacle. Ooh. Do you think that would have triggered that switch from earlier? Hmm. Fire grass fire. When was the last time you heard Rock Lobster, friends? Been quite a while here. <laughs> quite some time since I've heard it here. Uh, before I even contact my friend, I'm going to be trying to figure out how in the world they pack PCs so that I, like, I don't make a mistake in shipping and it gets to him and I find out that GPUs or something are just trash. That I believe in you. 
You got this. You got this. You can do it. You can do it. None of my moves really do anything. I switch somebody that does. Let's just take down the cat, yeah? Well, it's gotta be doable because people do it all the time. You, you, you can, 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 can do it. So close. Give me a crit. Give me a crit. No. I really thought we had it. Yeah, I'm sure it's possible. I just don't know if I have the resources to do so. I got you. I got you. Did you watch the Xbox Bethesda showcase? I've not watched any of the showcases yet, but I have seen several of the announcements, uh, and I'm, I'm pretty hyped. I'm pretty hyped. What was your favorite, Sneaky? There was one game that I thought of you for. Somebody described it as the No Man's Sky of, um, something. Can't remember how they put it. But they said it was very similar to No Man's Sky. Even then, I cannot guarantee it'll be the same as my PC. It may be a significant dip, step down from that, but still very respectable amongst the PC community. Yep. Just getting those right components in the right places makes a big diff. That's a bandana, and I definitely thought it was a gun. I 100% thought that was a gun. I mean, with every fiber of my being, I was certain that was a gun. Ikakuman! Bandana and a gun are a little different. Starfield by far, but there are some other games that were intriguing like Diablo 4. What was the game? There was a game that somebody described as No Man's Sky, and now I can't remember what it is, and it's bugging me. All right, I think I've done it, sir. Have you prepared for the real test? I think so. You do UPS ground, let them pack it. They will ensure it. They have they pack it right, and if something happens, they replace it. How we do it for work. Yep, that sounds good. Get it insured. It's Starfield. No, it wasn't. I know Starfield. Let me look it up. Hang on, hang on, hang on. It's going to bug me. It's going to bug me until I remember what it is. Let's see. Everything revealed. I'm most excited personally about Persona because I can't wait to be able to play Persona 3. I don't think it was Redfall. So maybe it wasn't the Bethesda showcase. Maybe it was another showcase. There were so many announcements made in the last week. But how could you even remember anything? But I'm gonna find it. I'm gonna find it. Nightingale. Maybe? I think it was Nightingale. 
I don't know if it's on the same scale as No Man's Sky, but that was what somebody described it as. And I haven't even watched the trailer, so I can't even vouch for that. Good, you show bravery, but this time you are not facing a normal monster. What is that? Oh, it's a little man. Oh, it's a little fella. This is just Digimon, dude. Steam Golem, particularly powerful monsters, are often described as di 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 champions. Yeah, I'm very excited about Starfield. They have more health, do more damage, and can act multiple times per turn. It is your job as a monster keeper to take care of them. Shipping from U.S. to Canada, I've never done anything cross-border shipping, so I have no idea what that's going to include. It's going to be expensive to insure it, but they will do it properly. It's only fitting that you beat one to become a member of the Order of Monster Keepers. Show me what you're made of. I'll do my best. All right, so I need wind. So Bird Friend is a great place to start. Buchanan is going to be another good one. And then I think... Who has a, I think... I think Titus might. Wonderful lose. That'd be kind of fun. Be kind of fun to lose one. He does have a whole different health bar, huh? Easy. Oh, this is going to be... Oh, he gets to go twice. Okay, cool. Maybe not as easy as I once thought. Buff us. Easy! Look at him, man. He's sweating. He knows we're good at this game. He knows we're good. He knows he ain't messing with no broke. I'm most excited about finally being able to play uh, Persona 3. Very excited about being, being able to play Persona 5 Royal on my phone again. The phone games are what's getting me, man. Being able to stream these games is just incredible. The fact that I'm able to do cloud play, that, that is the biggest game changer for me in video games in the past decade. I'm all about convenience. I'm all about being able to play a game wherever I'm at. And so that's a huge factor. I'm not, a, uh, I'm not somebody that often plays on a console. I grew up with handheld. I grew up with portables. So the more that I can play a portable game, the better and the happier I'll be. The real game changer. It appears your friend is running out of energy. Your steam man. Your steam man is running out of energy. He cannot hold up much longer. Our energy is too much for him. Although our energy is also running pretty low. I don't honestly know if we have another go. We do. Perfect. Thank goodness. You trying out for a role as one of the Russians in Stranger Fives or Stranger Things? Yeah. Either that or um, Hawkeye Season 2. Bro. Bro. Yes! Victory! Three stars, I'll take it. Yes! Congratulations, young one. You've defeated your first sample, and therefore you're now a keeper aspirant. Nothing more is required of you. I ever stay well in this moment because there are many things going on in sex where it troubles me. You see, monsters can't become as powerful by normal means, and champions usually don't accept other monsters beside them or a keeper in control of them. Champions are always an anomaly quite rare in nature. I enhanced this golem myself to make it stronger, but even I couldn't control it for longer periods of time, so I leave it deactivated most of the time. Recently, keeper rangers have been finding an unusual amount of champions around Sanctuary. 
I regularly receive letters by Vero mail from rangers who are stuck in the distant reaches of the sanctuary fighting against champions. If it weren't for my old bones, I'd go out there myself, but at least I can keep the keeper's trail safe. I trip to champion gives this area you can keep take care of it if you feel up to the task. Mountain path key Before you go as one more lesson I want to teach you. Don't worry, I don't have any other monsters for you to fight. This lesson is just about feeding your monsters. Two apples. Potatoes. Feeding your monsters will boost the stats. Caring for your monsters this way is vital if you intend to face more champion monsters, but the monster always only profits from the least three food items you gave to it. Now good luck on your road as a monster keeper. Well then, you're a keeper assistant. A aspirant now. Still, the only way to improve your rank is to beat more champions. And who knows, maybe you'll be the one to reach the title of Keeper Master. There's always only one in the couple of lifetimes. We can take care of that other champion right now, or we can go back to the Keeper Stronghold fo first. Foist. The choice is yours. Well, of course I want to take on the champion. <laughs> Digivolve. Into champion. Digivolve. Into ultimate. Now, do I remember where it was? I do not. I don't think it was down there. I don't think it was down there. Yeah. Oh, is this a secret wall? Is this a secret wall? I have a secret. I've been hiding under my skin. I'm just a man whose circumstances went beyond his control. Beyond his control. Beyond his control. I lose control. Nice, dude. We love to see it. Still don't know what sidekick means, though. Dang, a lot of throwbacks today, right? <laughs> yeah, I'm kicking back with some old songs there. Kicking back with some old songs. I got to see Styx in concert. But they didn't have their original lead singer, of course. That was a very impressive show. No! I tried to get around. I tried, I tried, I tried. Bird friend. All right, and then grass and water. Grass. Water. Bower. We just take him out. Got to see the he the Who a few years ago to take some clients out when I was doing consulting. That was a heck of a show. This show is all right. <laughs> the Stick Show is all right. Definitely the best shows I've ever seen were Paul McCartney and The Eagles. And then obviously The Bare Naked Ladies, but they're my favorite. I don't know, Ben Folds is pretty incredible because he had an orchestra. Those are definitely the top few. Top few for sure. You really can't go wrong. I just love concerts, dude. Big fan of concerts. Still jealous of my little bro who's seen Coheed and Cambria a ton and they put on a heck of a show. Yeah, I think that H-Man would equally be jealous. Although I think H-Man has seen them plenty of times and would still be jealous of not getting to see them for another time. It's the vibe I get anyway. It's the impression that I get. <laughs> Nice, dude. Getting good at this game. Getting better and better. See, this is what I think was the sprout. I'm gonna try. <laughs> Maybe not. I really thought that might do it. Ooh. Ooh, now that is fancy. It does give me just a little boost up, huh? Definitely not what I thought it was gonna do. Get good. 
am. I'm getting good. See, now I wonder if bird. Nope. Makes the rock go away. I'm excited for a Plague Tale Requiem. Really enjoyed the first Plague Tale. I've never played the first Plague Tale. Tell me about it. What is it like, Sneaky? I've always heard good things about it. Is it action? Is it action-packed? Or is it a narrative? Right in the middle of them. Just right in the middle of them. Just could not. I couldn't have put myself more in the middle of them if I tried to, dude. Like wind, I got. Grass, I got. Nice. Bow. Yeah, they all, I mean, it was, it was, it was so many, it was so many excellent announcements that it's really tough to pick just one. It's really tough. And it really was so many announcements in the course of like five days. Like, obviously I know that Buisha's uh, tweet that he posted of like all the new games was obviously a joke, but still the point stands there were a whole lot of really cool games announced out of nowhere. Strategy, smategy. Super emotional game and great music. Very interesting. I'm I'm super excited. This isn't from the showcase, but I really want to play that new um, the quarry game. Did you guys play, um, what is it called? What's the name of the game? What's the name of the game? Why can't I remember it? What's her name's in it? Save the cheerleader, save the world. What is the name of the game? Until Dawn. Thank you, Sneaky. Yeah. So Quarry is the new, is the new one of those. And I really want to play it. I hate that I had to save the cheerleader, save the world, just to know that name. And I still didn't even get it. It's on my list. I haven't played Until Dawn yet. Oh, we're missing out. That's a good one. It's a goodie. It's a goodie. I don't want to fight you. I've fought so many of you. You tire me. You bore me with your basic fights. These basic fights, they stand no challenge to me. I must take the champion. Are you the champion, Jawa friend? I believe you are! A monk! All right, grass. Grass. Let's start with Buchanan, get the defense in early. All right, I'm back. What's up, Chovy? Chovy, did you watch the all the all the announcements from the Summer Games Fest? What were your thoughts? That's what we were talking about while you were gone. I'd love to know what what your thoughts were. Ikakuma. Ooh, gnarly. Glory cast. Ikakuman says take no prisoners. Yeah, Starfield I'm hyped for, but I still prefer Elder Scrolls, Elden Scrolls. Elden Ring Scrolls, Elder Scroll Rings. Yeah, so the new, what was the Elder Scrolls? A new online announcement? Was that what they announced? I am admittedly ignorant of the ways of the Elder Scroll. Yup. I didn't know that online was still a thing. 
I didn't know they were still keeping up. But I think that's awesome. I'm glad that they are. Ikakuman, tackle. A new expansion for Elder Scrolls Online, yeah, it's still pretty popular. That's dope. I'm glad to hear it. I assume it is MMO. If I were forced to assume, that would be my assumption. I was hyped for all the Xbox Game Pass ones. Yeah, it's MMORPG. Obviously, Persona gets my goat just because I just love turn base. That's why I'm enjoying this game so much. Turn base games, they're just perfect. They're my favorite thing. can't not love them. Legally, I'm required to love them. Tried it a couple times, but I just couldn't get into it. That's how I feel about a lot of games. I'm going to, by the way, I am going, I'm saying it now, I'm vowing, I'm vowing before you. I am going to try Outer Worlds again. I'm going to try it again. I think I should try it on stream because maybe that'll hold me accountable. But I am so many people keep telling me that it's such a good game I've got to try it I gotta experience it it too many people love it too much for me to just not try it and yes I got very turned off from it from the very beginning but that doesn't mean that it's a bad game outer worlds or outer wilds outer wilds outer worlds I loved and I beat and I thought about playing the DLC and I never did big fan of outer worlds But I also love Fallout, and those are basically just Fallout. They're more narrative Fallout. More of a linear Fallout, I guess. Okay. I'm barely ever using heal. I'm mostly using slime and rain. Fallout with the good stuff. Luke Frost has been playing Outer Wilds. Could ask him about it. Yep, he's one of the ones that has made me want to play it. Because I see him playing it, and I'm just jealous. Jealous, I need to know. I need to know what's so good about it. H Man loves it so much. H Man enjoyed it a whole lot. I need to know what's to love. Is that a whole other side? Yeah. So why can't I unlock these yet? Oh, Interessant. Okay, I get it. I get it. Neat. So I just gotta get these guys to level 10. That's what it sounds like. I never got into Fallout, but I keep trying and forced myself to finish them. I love Fallout. Big fan. I couldn't stop playing them. I wish I could play them again. If I had, those are games that I wish I had the ability to play again for the first time. An Ocarina? Oh, no. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, gee whiz. Oh, man. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Oh, man. Well, I wonder if I can go tell the guy that I beat his champion. Hey, Oberon. I beat your champion. Give me a prize. Can I have a present? Can I have a present from you, Oberon? Give me a present. Give me a present, please. Oh. Okay, let's see. Fire and Grace. I think the setting turns me off. I don't know. I should love Fallout more than I do. I think it depends on, like, 
I think I played Fallout at the perfect time. I think that has a lot to do with a lot of games, actually. Games that I love, I played at the right time. That's why I don't like Outer Wilds. It's because I'm, I'm not able to play it at the time that it would impact me the most. I don't have the time to devote to it. I wish I did, but I just don't. So I'm having so much trouble getting into it. I don't have the headspace for it. Nice, dude. Oh, yes. Oh, no. <laughs> Man, come on. What are they weak to? Weak to fire. Well, at least I poisoned it. I'll take poison. Poison will do. Uh, I played. I liked Fallout a lot, but I got seriously burned out on Fallout 4. Never played Fallout 76. What burns you out from Fallout 4? Because that depends on if you should play Fallout 6 or not, or Fallout 76 or not. If you got burned out on what I bet burned you out, then you shouldn't. <laughs> but if you got burned out on something else, then you should give it a shot. There's a chance. A chance you might enjoy it. It's a good game. I actually enjoyed 4 more than 3, but never played 76. I also enjoyed... Well, I don't know if I can say more. That's really tough. I enjoyed them both a lot. But they're definitely both better than 76. But 76 is also really good. Especially after all the changes and adjustments. Don't let people just hate it. Which is opposite of everyone I talk to. Lots of Bethesda employees got burned out making 76 too. Yup. Yeah, that was definitely one of the roughest. Roughest goes. Those games are so intense. And fans don't do any favor. Fans do not do any favors to the devs whenever they complain them. <gasps> Yowie! I got another Yowie. I still don't know why I have multiple Mon. Is there a way to do something about that? Can I upgrade them? I feel like I got too many Mon. Got all these extra eggs. Maybe I sell them? If I don't want a bonus Yowie? I'd like to fuse them. Taco article came out recently on that. Nasty crunch and mismanagement. I believe it. If I remember correctly, I played Fallout 3 and 4 almost back to... Ooh, that's... Yeah, that's rough. Yeah, that's not a good idea. Hello there, you defeated the champion monster. I told you about World done, Jack. Trust me, you're really helping the sanctuary. Become a saver place by defeating champion monsters. Show the world that I taught you well and defeat as many champions monsters as possible. You really didn't teach me much. And that's all you had to say? I walked all the way back to that. Yeah, that would be a lot. I don't think I could handle that. I love Fallout, and I don't think I could play them back-to-back. -back. I I still have yet to play New Vegas. Beyond, um... I got to a certain point that I don't want to spoil for anybody that hasn't played the game. But, um... I, I can't. I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't. I just couldn't care. And I feel so guilty. But I just couldn't care anymore. I got New Vegas on Steam, just haven't had time. Some of my favorite question quest lines were in New Vegas, but near not the same or they're not the same devs, so I don't know. And I enjoy the devs between New Vegas, because I think was it wasn't it New Vegas devs that made Outer Worlds? Am I wrong about that? We were literally just talking about. Kinda like a horror game. Interesting. Yes, yeah, I thought so. And I really enjoyed Outer Worlds. So you would think that I would really enjoy New Vegas. And I'm sure I would if I gave it the time. But again, it's, it goes back to that uh, It goes back to that having the headspace. And I just don't have it. And if you just don't have it, you just don't have it. You don't got it to give. What are you going to do about it? Sanctuary. Let's see. We got wind, wind, wind. Wind, 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 wind. Wind, 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 wind. Ikakuma!
Still don't know what any of these things mean. She's got all these move sets. I don't know what any of them mean. Four minutes left on stream, folks. This has been a great stream. I appreciate you hanging out with us. I appreciate the raid. Appreciate all the good things that have gone on. I've really enjoyed this game. Capcom showcase going on right now, too. Interesting. Street Fighter VI, I imagine. What else is Capcom going to do? If they announce a new, if they announce new Phoenix right, I'm going to lose my mind. I'm going to lose my mind. I don't foresee that happening, though. But if they did, I'd be tickled. I'd be tickled pink if a new Phoenix Wright came out. Simply tickled. Yeah, that's, that's a wind move. That's not a grass move. That's why these aren't doing any damage. Phoenix, am I right? I would love a new Phoenix Wright game. Although I still haven't played the old ones. All of them. I haven't played, like, um, Dual Destinies or whatever it is. There's a couple of them in there that I haven't played. So I really have no room to talk. But I will anyway. Just because I have no room doesn't mean that I won't speak. But that's all I know Capcom for. Street Fighter and Phoenix. I'd like to get to the sanctuary and then I'll save and we'll close up shop for today. Oh yeah, by the way, people that care, I got a, I got a new car. I did, I did get a new car and I love that it only took one day. I hate car shopping. I hate car shopping. And we can talk about it on tomorrow's stream if you want to know more. But I did get a new car. Sonic the Sorrento is gone. Used car. Only used for us. Boom. Oh, look. Is that because I defeated those champions? Do I get champions each time? Curious. Curiouser and curiouser. Yeah. Yeah, we pretty much only get we pretty much only get used cars. But officially, uh, it's a it's a Subaru, which is kind of weird. But I I uh, I used to love my um, Toyota Highlander, and they drive very similar. So. And it's big enough for babies. Chats in the clap for two babies being able to comfortably fit in a car. Woohoo! We love two babies fitting in a car. Big fan of two babies fitting in a car. Folks, for those of you that are here and don't know how you ended up here, you probably came on with the x -Gen, uh, Ninja uh, Raid, and we appreciate that so much. But we are Checkpoint Church. We're really a church building a church online um, here on Twitch, Discord, and YouTube. We put out the streams three days a week. Uh, except for this week, only two, because Thursday I'll be at a conference. So only Monday and Tuesday this week. And then we also are always active on our Discord 24-7. Exclamation point Discord in the chat if you want to learn more about that. And then on Sundays, every Sunday, we put out a nerdy sermon. The one this past Sunday was on Obi-Wan Kenobi, the new series on Disney+. Plus. So if you want to learn more about my thoughts on Obi-Wan Kenobi, I, I love, love it. it! And you can find out why I love it and what it has to do with us as believers, as Christian peoples, uh, what we can learn from it and how we can grow from it. We'd love for you to support us in that way. We'd love to support you in that way with these things that we're getting to put out there to edify your soul with the things that you love. And with that, we're going to wrap up stream. Folks, we believe three things to be true about every single one of you out there, regardless of whether or not you believe in God. Don't believe in God. Go to church. Don't go to church. Enjoyed this stream. Didn't enjoy this stream. Love Obi-Wan Kenobi. Don't love Obi-Wan Kenobi. None of those things change. These three things that we believe to be true about every single one of you watching at any point in time, whether you're watching live or on the VOD. Number one, we believe that God loves you, like really, really loves you, no matter who you are, what you've done. Number two, we believe that we love you. We want community with you. That's what we're doing here, trying to forge relationships, get to know you, learn more about you, welcome you into the fold. And number three, we believe that you, yes, you matter. You are a person of sacred worth. The world is a better place. Why? Because you are in it. Folks, with that, we are going to pay forward our raid and find somebody else to raid real quick. Let me pull out creator dashboard. Boop, 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 boop. Uh, let's see on my live channels. I got Just Zach, Delkery, and Susie live. Uh, I feel like we should raid. Susie's got so many, man. I feel like either Just Zach or Delkery would be a good. I feel like we raided Just Zach last time, so we're gonna do Delkery this time. Yeah, I think that sounds fair. Does that sound fair to everybody? That sounds fair. All right, we're gonna raid Delkery. Um, Delkery's playing Madden. <laughs> 
is like, there's no game I would be further from. Um, but yeah, we're going to go raid Delkri. Hey, thank you so much, Tovi. Hope to catch you around the, the Discord. Um, but yeah. We're going to go watch some John Madden. John Madden. Tough acting to Nacton. Go, uh, go spam the chat with tough acting to Nacton. Does everybody know how to spell that? I think it's this way. I think it's tough acting to Nacton. Tough acting to Nacton. Go post a bunch of tof, tough, tough acting to Nacton. Really confused Elkery here. Um, and we'll go raid over there. So we're going to raid in 10 seconds. Folks, again, I thank you so much. We are raiding Delkery. You did read that correctly. We're going to raid with a bunch of tough acting to Nacton over in the chat since he's playing a little John Madden, John Madden football, NFL 22. Folks, thanks again for being here. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow, same time, same place, or over on our Discord right now. That's where I'm going to hop after this. So, till next time, bye bye.